it's unfortunate that people are becoming helpless day in day out because government is not even listening to them. The People's Democratic Party (PDP) ward chairman and twelve others have been feared killed in a bloody invasion of a Takpa community in Obi local government area of Benue State by suspected armed SME. But the state police command claimed only two corpses were recovered from the attacked community. An eyewitness who spoke on condition of anonymity claimed the suspected SME numbering eight armed with AK-47 rifles invaded the area in four motorbikes at about 9 p.m. on Sunday and began shooting sporadically, killing their victims and injuring many. Among the 13 bodies found were two women in their 30s, he said. Confirming the development, the caretaker chairman of the local government, Mr. Joseph Ikwei, said the attackers invaded the community at about 9 p.m. on Sunday night and started shooting indiscriminately and killing anything in sight. He informed that some of the victims were people who had gathered at the residence of the local government chairman-elect to celebrate her victory after the pre previous day's council election. After killing their victims, the government took away all the cattle kept in the ranch of the lawmaker representing Obi in the state assembly. He explained that the attack was the second this year after a similar incident a few weeks ago. According to him, about 3,000 persons have been displaced by the attack and are currently taking refuge at the LGEA Primary School, Obarike Ito. The police have, however, mobilized their personnel to the, personnel to the area. On his part, first class chief in the area is Royal Highness Ogaero, retired commissioner of police, who confirmed the incident, claimed 13 of his subjects were killed in the attack. The monarch said the suspected Esme had on May 9th attacked Echori, a neighboring community where they killed two persons. Ero said, but the latest attack was on Sunday when they attacked Itakpa at about 9 p.m. when the people were already in their home relaxing. They shot and killed 13 persons. Many people were wounded and currently receiving treatments at General Hospital. Oba. Rike Itu, headquarters of OB, local government. When contacted, the police public relations officer, PPRO, Catherine Aneni, said, We were, when we got to the area, only two corpses were found by somebody's farm. We searched and searched and the whole area and found nothing again. Mm. So the commissioner of police went back to the community and asked where the people the killed way. The villagers claim that in their culture they don't show corpses to the police so we cannot confirm what we did not see. So the uh, issue now is that whether one person, whether half person, whether two people, whether ten people is inconsequential. The most important thing, even if it is only one, it's not supposed to be happening. Why is it that these people have not be, been caught? You know, it's like a Benue State is their is the epicenter. They just go there uh, any time, any day, and they always get away with it. Do they really arrest these people? No, they don't arrest them. It's been happening and happening, just like what they are saying now. It's this is the second time it's happening again. The first time it happened, you know, the same thing. They will come and tell us, oh, they are going to bring to book those who perpetrated that act, but up to today, nothing happened. And again, it's happening again. So what tells you now that it will not happen again? And we are talking about it the second time in, uh, this year. Do you know how many that happened last year, year before, and all of that? It's a uh, it's a, a, a continuous thing, and it will continue because the ones who did it, who did that, that's at a, how many years ago, were they captured, were they arrested? No, and it's been going on, on, on and on. Whether it is only one person or two people, it's inconsequential. That is not what we are talking about. The ones that have been happening now that you you were aware of that you could say, oh, you confirmed. Have you been able to arrest those people? No, they have not been able to arrest them. So telling us that uh, what is not, whether the PDP is not there or this one, that the people know what they are talking about. The ones you've confirmed in the past are many police people. The ones they've confirmed in the past, what did they do about it? It is still nothing, business as usual. 
Okay. Someone say, yeah, what police is saying? Only two people. It shows clearly <laughs> the value we attach to human life in this country. One black man was extrajudicially murdered in America by a police officer. See the spontaneous reaction from women who value lives. S. Mekilis in Nigeria has become picnic. Mm, re picnic. Yet no one raises an eyebrow against such barbaric killings. It's only God that knows the end of this killing since the government of the day seems to be on the side of the killers. God is greater than them. And at the appointed time, everyone will give account of his tea worship to the Almighty God. That's what Abba Bernard said. Emily Komolafe said, Every day they used to kill they used to kill you, but you don't try to do anything about it. Is the is the person that help himself that God will help? Fight back. <laughs> Oh, just like they always say, everyone have those those who have themselves. This is not a scripture. People just like put that one. But you know, on a lighter note, this is not a, 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 a something that someone is to be joking with. You know, do you think it is easy? I don't know whether it is easy for people to just be fighting, but people who are normally they that is not their that is not their plan. That is not what they bargain for. That is not the kind of people they are. Do you, of course, you know when somebody pushes you to the to the war, you have to face face them back. But for how long are they going to do that? It is the responsibility of the of the government to be able to protect them. But unfortunately, the government is not protecting them. So that is why it's, it's like it's now difficult. How many people are they going to be recruiting? That means, because these people who are committing this advocate, this uh, the so called uh, esme. It is, it is, whether it is in their DNA, that is, they have an agenda. You know, when somebody has, when somebody has an agenda, it is always easy for the person to be able to perpetrate whatever agenda or to display it or to bring it to limelight. But for somebody who it is not, it is not your, your thing, it's going to be too difficult. So it is see the government that will do the needful. I'm just saying this because if really it is possible, these people would have been retaliating you know it's it's only when you hear occasionally that there's a kind of reprisal and it's a one thing one time thing not every time but these people they are they are doing it this so-called me they are doing it steadily they are carrying out this whole thing steadily because they have an agenda you can't compare with somebody who is trying to fend for his family so it's really really difficult we cannot even see blame the people all that but the same at the same time the blame should continue to go to the to the to the to the government okay every day okay that's what this person has already said that they should fight back god will support you those you think will help you are the ones that gave them cows so there's nobody that is going to help you unless you fight for yourself okay so bad but the community should assist the security agents with good information to tackle the challenges vigilances should be informed to secure should be formed to secure the community by youth. They should not only be running after politicians and forget themselves. Everyone was celebrating rigged spools and forgot the forgot to be secure, security conscious when the attackers came. Who even know whether some aggrieved opposition are part of the attackers? Mm -hmm. Anything can happen. It is high time state creates security outfits to tackle this menace. Enough of the incessant scalings of innocent souls. Mm -hmm. The same story upon story upon story, the same story upon story every day, every now and then. And the thing is still continue to happen. Mm -hmm. Now, wow. This one, now, wow. This one, now, wow. Mm -hmm. Fulani Esme are wicked people. It's Akma community and the entire OB. Local government, get your arms, protect yourself because the police can't protect you. Of course, it is clear. Don't run out don't run how long don't know how long uh, you will be able to run okay don't run how long are you going to be running away from them hashtag now is fight for your life and family the police have however mobilized their personnel to the area after the damage has been done this regime has no grip on the country god forbid another one like it it is like a judgment of the country as anything good ever comes out of Benry, if not caught his esme, what is wrong with the state safe? Hmm. Someone says, okay, it's a Francisca Odiga, Dane Amokachi, two face esoteric. Okay, from your state. Okay, it's okay. This is uh, prominent people. When this person is asking that, 
whether good things has come uh, come out from that seat and somebody is quoting those okay Danny Amokachi is Danny Amokachi from Benway okay or t- okay two face maybe okay are there no evil occurrence in your state learn to stick to the subject matter and don't demean the integrity of a people may the full learning nightmare continue to follow you follow whoever is reporting uh and uh, uh, all manner of things which state courtes and esme never came before mention one state let me hear the fulani esme has mission remain silent and die defenseless no security ideas in nigeria hmm. they have mission there's a mission that is why they are not tired and they are they are they are, they are getting bolder and bold, bolder every day Something is telling me that these people are paying the price of killing the Igbo during the war. Okay, this one has, has come out with a, come up with another thing. So, guys, let's hear your opinion because this is really pathetic, very, very pathetic. <laughs>